What is up everybody, this is your host Supersite and welcome back to another video of Heyday. Now in this video I'm going to be showing you the survey that was given to a few of us as a special, I don't, I don't know if, if, if it's considered a privilege or not, I consider it a privilege that I was granted the opportunity to do a survey, which I did, and I'll be showing you that very survey now. Now, I was quite surprised that not everyone got the survey, because I was talking to, uh, Lynn commented that she didn't get the survey, I'm like, really? Like, I thought they'd just give everyone the survey, anywhere they didn't, and so I was like, whoa, I got the survey, that's awesome. And so I will be showing you this survey in this video, which is right here, and I'll be going through that and just, uh, refilling it out, although I won't submit the final response, but I'll just show you what it was, because only a few players, I don't know how many, was it 50%, was it 5%, was it 1% that got it, I don't know, but it was, it was a good survey. Anyway, we did get this reward thing right here, which was the, val and by the way, happy Valentine's Day, I know it's late, like, quite late, to uh, yeah, today's like, is in anyway, it's a bit late, but anyway, happy Valentine's Day, I hope you had, why well, I hope you had a good, happy Valentine's Day. Anyway, we got the we got the award. I did participate and just made it. Although I wish I'd made it further with more thresholds, but this works for me. Hi, Superzai HD YouTube. Thank you for everyone's participation in the global event. We did it together, and it was a success. Please accept this reward as a thank you for your contributions. I'll thank you too. So there we go. There you have it. I got this this cool looking thing, which is right here. I like it. The heart gate. That that is quite quite cool. Unique Valentine's Day decoration. There we go. Oh my goodness me. That's way bigger than I thought. That is way, way bigger. Like, if you look at it like this, I just sort of imagined it would be, like, about this size right now. And then you put it down, it's like, wowzers, wowzers. Anyway, that can go in there. That looks cool. There's the fox. The fox was still trying to catch, which has not yet come. But eventually, one day, we'll get that fox as a pet. So there we go. I, and I, I, th I feel like it's time that it's had its time, that horse. I, it's just average. But, yeah, this thing here looks quite cool. Can we put it in, in the archway of a tree? No, we can't. But we can't. Can we turn around this way? Yeah, that works. But still a bit hidden. Right, we give it some, some nice exposure right there. There we go. We can look at this lovely heart-shaped thing. That is cool. Oh, and a diamond offer have we got? Oh, well, we've got we've got special offers. That's kind of cool. So we have special offer one, which was like with some things. Is this to do with the Chinese New Year? I would assume so. I don't know, but that looks kind of cool. We've got a gate thing, and then we with the lantern. I like the lanterns. They look awesome. And then we have the second offer with is that an owl? I'm not sure, but that looks. Cool, I'm not sure, it, I, it's hard to tell because they never do it to the actual size, like the decoration size, because I wish it was proportionate, because some things are like way smaller or way bigger, than, I think the majority of things I find way bigger than I assume, but that's that one there, and then you have the special offer three, which is the two, it's got like a little dog out the side, and then it's got the big dog statue, I think it's cool with that cool Chinese symbol right there, and then like comparatively, you definitely go for the ones with decorations, because the same price as the ones that don't have the decorations, so yeah, if you spend diamonds, and you like decorations, now's the time to spend. There we go, so we got that right there, and, and our barn is full, as always, although we are getting very close, should we go looking? This, this is one of my, against one of my rules, mate, well, I try only ever going shopping if I have more than, more than a 10, ten space at least, because other, no, that's annoying, that's really annoying, otherwise you go there, and sometimes you, there's like great bargains, and you can't, oh my goodness me, oh my goodness me, and it, Oh, that was such a fail right there. That was such a very big fail. I at least I got the the nails, but I missed I missed the flipping hammers and the ah. Oh, that was painful. But yeah, no, that's that's what you get when you went right. And we've got a boat event right. What what is that? There we go. Okay, so we've got that, which will get us this, which all five diamonds. But still, not I, I'm not a big fan of boat events to be honest. Yeah, I couldn't have got it anyway, because, see, that's why you need a, you need an empty, yeah, what, what have I got in here that's filling it up? I got a bit too much milk and stuff like that. Oh, and the Wheel of Awesome, that's right, and three, two, one, let's see what we're going to get, and so, hopefully the jackpot, I'm always, I'm always hoping and betting on the jackpot, but we'll see, what could it be, it could be, keep going, keep going, stop, 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 stop. okay, pickaxe, I'm happy with the pickaxe, that, that works for me, let's go check out Greg, which will probably, we won't, right, okay, we'll just come along here, we'll have, oh, sure, oh, sh which we can't get, we can do that and that, then we'll sell off 10 of something, right, there we go, so we'll do 10 milk, where's 10 milk, there we go, boom, and then back to Greg, and then we'll buy those two, and then it's survey time, that is right, okay, so going into the survey, so hopefully it doesn't stop me from doing it, so we're going to press go, which takes us right here, and as you can see, right, so we've got that there, and all that, um, right, so what, what was that one, are you human, are you human, what, what is this? Are you human? Okay, I don't know. Right, okay, so, anyway, 
Right, so coming back to this, which, uh, yeah, okay, so we're back here, and we've got this here. So, here we go, hello, neighbor. I, I, I don't know what that was. Anyway, never mind. Maybe it was, I have no idea what that was. Anyway, hello, neighbor, thank you for responding to the in-game message. That's okay. <laughs> we wanted to learn more about you and your experience, Blaine. Hey, Dave, please take a few minutes to fill out the survey. Thank you. So, there we go. Right, so we will press this one right here, which is the one, so it's powered by... That company right there, or that thing. Anyway, so we press this, and there we go, it says... So these are the questions. Only a few people got to see this. So, what is your current heyday XP level? And so I'm level 53, so we tap that one right there. So we press next. So it's the first one. How often do you typically play heyday? Now, this is it's kind of like... It's it's an easy question, and it's a hard question. Like, because sometimes I just won't play for ages, because I, I, I'm really busy, or I go on a camp or something, and then it will be, like, obviously, none. And, like... If the camp was a week, none in a week, because I don't play it on, on the camp. But at, at times, like regular times, I do play it multiple, multiple times a day. I normally play it at least twice a day, normally. But again, there's times there, and so I'm just going to go multiple times per day, right? Because, like, yeah, that's generally what it is, although I do have breaks sometimes. Next one here. So, how many members are in your neighborhood? And this, again, it's like... For a person that's, you know, I'm sort of, because I'm a player that sort of does heaps of stuff and doesn't do heaps of stuff. So right now it's just me. It's, oh, I know, actually there's three of us in the hood. But yeah, normally, like, well, with my main hood, it has been like that. But anyway, currently we're just with this. So there we go, one to five. So that's me right now. Do you participate in the derby? And so, and then again, it's like, yes, I do participate, but I haven't for a few weeks. So then it's like... So then, no, but I have p participated in the past. So there we go. That was then the next question, which I did that one there. So, of course, for all of you, it will be different responses, right? And so why have you stopped participating in the derby? Right, there we go. I, I'm i not in a... Na oh, well, that would be one reason. Too much pressure. I don't like the competition. I don't like the rewards. Non-contributing neighbors can collect rewards. That is a bit annoying. That's not the reason. The reason is I'm busy, but that is really annoying. Not enough members in my hood. I don't... Un I didn't, there wasn't, you don't have to have a certain amount of members, I didn't think. You can just do a one-on-one -on -one derby, I'm pretty sure. Unless people wanted to do it a whole heap. I don't understand the derby, right? I understand the derby, fine. Uh, and I don't mind competition, and I, I, who doesn't like the rewards? Like, seriously, it's rewards! But of course, if you don't like the rewards, well, that's an option you can select. But I love the rewards, and I don't find it too much pressure, although I don't like doing it when I'm unsure about how busy I'll get, because I don't want to fail my hood. Uh, my neighbours don't want to participate Again, that do it doesn't really affect whether I'd participate. So too much, too time consuming. Uh, yes, I would. I would say that. Although, again, I don't want to be sort of like skewing these results in the sense that I don't want it to look like. I'm like, that's the reason, like, why, and I don't want them to cut it down, because the reality is, if it's, when it's not too time consuming, it's great, but yeah, so there we go, like, when I have lots of time, I can do it, and by the way, the questions are different based on which, like, things you select, they change, right, next one, right, which are the following reasons, oh, so yeah, it's, it's definitely, it's a different line of questions, because, uh, yeah, with the, I put, yes, I participate in Derby, and I hadn't, I hadn't that week, but that's what I regularly do, so that's what I put, so I got different questions. Anyway, which of the following reasons would cause you to consider to participate in the derby? Again, select all that apply. Better understand the derby. I understand that fine. If my neighborhood met more members, no, I'd still do it. If I felt less pressure, no, not really. If I if it was less, well, it, it's sort of like a back and forth thing. It's like, it goes one way. If you don't understand the derby, then understanding the derby would help you participate. But yeah, that one there, we yeah, and also I almost would be inclined to put this one here. Not that that's the reason I stopped, but it is sort of preventing inactive members from collecting rewards. That, yeah, I think that would be a bit more fair, because if you have people that are messing up the derby, it's really not fair. It was less competitive, and I love the competition. The competition's great. Better rewards? Uh, that, yeah, it would be. I'd like to see better rewards, but that wouldn't be the reason why I stopped participating. And if I was in a neighborhood, well, yeah, of course. If you're not in one, you have to get in one. But it's only 500 coins to get in one. So Anyway, there we go. We'll put that there. Uh, what is the least favorite part about playing Heyday? Select all that apply. Oh, least favorite part. I don't know if such a thing exists. Yeah, well, okay, let's look, look at them. Leveling up my farm. Yeah, it's, it's not my favorite part, but it's still fine. I like leveling up. Collecting pets. Well, I don't have any pets, so yes and no. Like, no in the fact that you can't really answer that option if you don't have it, but yes in the fact that 
If I did, I don't know. But anyway, fishing, yeah, fishing is a bit annoying uh, sometimes. Like, sometimes it can be great, but other times it's like, especially when you're trying to catch the red-tailed catfish. Come on, and you have to wait 10 minutes or 50 minutes to try and finally get it. And if you miss it, it's so annoying. So, yes, I would possibly put fishing, although I don't hate fishing. Fishing can be good, but sometimes, sometimes it gets a little bit boring, just personally. Decorating my farm. Hey, there we go. Uh, least favorite part. Well, it's not my least, fa I don't know, least favorite, fishing or decorating my farm. Well, I don't decorate my farm, although, because fishing gives you coins, but decorating your farm doesn't. It just uses your coins. Uses, uses, for me. I find that, I feel like it's a waste of coins as of a low level. But, of course, decorations can be great, and I certainly, as I get higher Level, I'm gonna get I'm just gonna absolutely nail with those decorations and people will be like whoa what happened you actually buying decorations now yes okay growing expanding my farm actually that's one of my favorite parts like, I love expanding the farm and what else do I, I, I like what was the other one I like growing my farm and I like uh, the barn upgrades that's really cool socializing with my neighborhood unfortunately I don't do that as much as I'd like to but that's I, I enjoy doing that as well as I, li I like all these things I do like fishing sometimes but sometimes it's a bit annoying blame the t play playing the town um, yeah that's all right that's all right playing in the derby that's awesome collecting buildings collecting buildings as in like you accumulate all the buildings as you buy them, or collecting the products from the buildings. I don't know. Either way, both of those are fine. I love collecting lots of buildings and collecting the products from the buildings. Well, yeah, of course, I love that. It's like, hey, I'm going to get to sell this for profit. You're beating in the leaderboards. That is one of my favorite things. I love leaderboards. I love statistics. I love, you know, the competition. That's great. Participating in the events. Uh, no, the fishing event. I love the fishing event. It's I don't particularly like the boat event, but the fishing event and virtually all the events are pretty cool. Taking care of my animals. That is fine, although it is one of the hardest things to keep all the feed there, but it is a good challenge. So I'm just going to put fishing. Okay, so next one here. What is the next thing right here? Uh, please provide any additional feedback. Okay, so that that's it. That's it. Uh, I will go back and I'll show you uh, another line that you... Oh, right. You can... Un you can only go back one. You can only go back one. That's slightly annoying. But yeah, there are different lines which would, if you put that you are participating in the derby, it would ask you all about the derby and what you liked about the derby and the, whether you like the bingo derbies and so on. And so yeah, there are, there are some of the questions that some of us received while we got to participate in. And so yeah, that's what it was. Uh, I thought I'd just do a video so you can understand and see what we got to do. Uh, but yeah, that, that was it. That was it right there, which was kind of cool. I was happy to be able to help out with the survey, which will give them data, which will give them good feedback and so they, they can do stuff based on what the commu Heyday community is feeling. So yeah, I just thought I'd do a quick video on the Heyday survey and that, and so I hope you don't feel like you've missed out. Maybe you'll be lucky enough for it to be you next time, and it'll be me that's missing out and watching the video of what the questions were in the survey I got to miss out on. But I like I like participating in it. It's, it's awesome. Anyway, I really hope you enjoyed this video, and so next video I think will be about Tom. That, that that's, the, that's what I'm thinking. Anyway, please leave a like if you enjoyed it. Please subscribe if you're new to my channel. This has been your host, Subasite, and remember to make coins faster than honeybees make honey.